What is eosinophilic pneumonia? Patients with eosinophilic pneumonia often present with rapidly progressive shortness of breath, which can escalate to acute respiratory failure in severe cases. Additional symptoms include persistent cough, fatigue, night sweats, fever, and unintended weight loss. Hypoxia may be observed in advanced cases. Acute eosinophilic pneumonia, AEP, is defined as a rare disorder involving a rapid accumulation of eosinophils, a type of white blood cell, in the lungs. These cells are generally produced in response to allergens, infections, or inflammation. Diagnosis is usually a combination of clinical presentation, laboratory tests, and imaging. CBC with differential often shows elevated eosinophil counts in the blood are often indicative of the condition. Bronchoalveolar lavage, BAL, often shows eosinophilia in BAL fluid confirms the diagnosis and can show eosinophil levels significantly higher than what is typically seen in peripheral blood. Chest X-rays and high-resolution CT scans generally reveal diffuse bilateral infiltrates. While CT scans may not specifically differentiate eosinophilic pneumonia from bacterial pneumonia, they are important for ruling out other conditions. Some cases of eosinophilic pneumonia are linked to infections from bacteria like Streptococcus and parasites like Ascaris lumbricoids or Strongyloides stercorilis. The disease is extremely rare and specific statistical data are limited. However, most cases are idiopathic, with some triggered by external factors like changes in smoking habits or drug intake. The disease can be idiopathic or triggered by changes in tobacco use or medication. Treatment generally involves corticosteroids, and outcomes are often favorable without relapses. For further information, you can consult resources like the National Organization for Rare Disorders, NORD, and the American Thoracic Society, ATS.